We literally just got dropped off on an island from a dude I've never met until now. And now we're stranded on an island in Alaska. There goes our only way out of here. Ever since the beginning of this YouTube channel, I've been making videos from trips to visit my friend Isaac since he moved so often for his job. Sitka, Alaska is now the third place he's lived since the videos began, but with him getting ready to move once again, I planned one final trip to visit so that I could experience this incredible part of the world one last time. Mine is too firm. Yeah, mine, mine, hold on. Actually, it's not bad, but I'm a side sleeper. Are you big spoon or little spoon? Middle spoon. <laughs> Middle spoon. <laughs> Isaac is leaving Sitka. So this is the final trip to Sitka ever. The house is freaking empty. Except for like a pile of stuff. And the coffee stuff. Hot sauce. We got a hotel room since everything's moved out of the house. But there's only one bed for three of us. So we opted for a slumber party instead. Can you lay down now, Jake? Now we can lay down. Can you a YouTuber now, Jake? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it smells like an apple. You look so Alaska. <laughs> Where are we going right now? To get Steve. <laughs> Steve is another longtime friend of ours, so we just had to pick him up from the airport and get started making this the best <laughs> last trip to Sitka possible. What's up, idiot? <laughs> Welcome to Alaska. <laughs> Having a friend that lives in Alaska is amazing. I'll never take for granted how special it is to get to go see Isaac and also be in such an incredibly beautiful place. But once again, this trip was another reminder that the place you visit is really just the cherry on top. The way more important piece is who you get to share the trip with. One for the grandkids, boys. Oh, when he does that, you just go about your business. Oh, <laughs> just do natural things, but try to be better looking. <laughs> when I'm filming, I always find myself trying to get the, the perfect composition or the most beautiful lighting I can get. But then once I start editing, my favorite shots are always just the really simple ones that capture a good memory. Get in, we're going putt putt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Shakira. What is Shakira? <laughs> My hips don't lie, Jake. And we're about to get Run. the greatest group photo get up, buddy. that anyone has ever seen. It's not blinking. It never was. Look. Oh! <laughs> What happened? Did die? I ripped my pants. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool from this perspective. You gotta try this. What do you mean? I, I don't want to. There's no net in the way. It's like you're the dude in the, uh, the crow's nest of a ship. Lando! <laughs> In the last video I made here, Isaac mentioned how stuck you can feel with just a car in Sitka because there's only 13 miles of road. Thankfully, since this was the last trip here, Isaac's friend Blake helped us solve that problem this time. What do you want to know? I want to know how long you've been in Alaska and... I've been, I've been in Alaska going on three years now. Okay. Where from originally? From Texas. It's quite the difference. Yeah. But I love it. Some days I wonder if I'm ever going to go back because there's a lot of adventures that I haven't went on yet that I still gotta go do. Are we going anywhere else? Who knows, we're going to a magical world. We're going to a magical world. I'm staying still. <laughs> Taking a boat around Alaska, maybe to some hot springs, maybe look for orca whales, hopefully at least whales of some kind. You know, up here it's like the boat's the new car. That's, like I said, that means freedom up here. A lot of people here, 
you know, they, they never get out on a boat, so they don't get to truly experience what Seca has to offer. I guess it wouldn't be special if everyone went and did it though. <laughs> yeah. So true. Yeah. How long are you gonna be? Oh, uh, I thought I was going home. <laughs> <laughs> we literally just got dropped off on an island from a dude I've never met until now. And now we're stranded on an island in Alaska. Good idea, Isaac. Left for dead, there's your, there's your YouTube title. <laughs> Left to die with only. There goes our only way out of here. Okay, I might have been a little dramatic. Uh, Blake just had to anchor the boat further out so that when the tide goes down, we don't end up actually stranded for the night. Well, we found the hot spring. Okay. It's definitely nicer than I was imagining. <laughs> Jake. What? You oh. gotta fly your drone through this. Oh, absolutely, while we're all sitting in there. This is ridiculous. I'm honestly not sure if I'll ever make it back to Sitka or not. I've I found this weird tension with traveling where almost anywhere I go I really want to go back because there's such good memories there and I I know how much that place has to offer. But, but there are just so many places on my list that I want to visit and if Isaac keeps moving to more interesting places, who knows, maybe I'll just follow him wherever he ends up. Jake. That is beautiful. I like it because of the way that it is. Obviously, nothing is certain. Who knows if someday I'll be back, but for now, I would say that this is the official goodbye to Sitka. So, thanks for everything. What do you think you'll miss most about living in Alaska? Honestly, the silence.